All right, hello guys. Welcome back to another episode of our GI support ingredient breakdown here, where we're going over each one of the ingredients that I have used in GI support. Um, just giving a rundown of what they do, why they're in this product, um, and how you can benefit from them. So today we're going to be talking about uh, zinc L-carnosine and the trademark version of this ingredient is known as pepsin GI. Um, this is a pretty relatively new ingredient, actually three of the ingredients in GI support um, you may not have heard of. So again, that's why I'm making these videos to inform you guys um, uh, just what's going on here and what these benefits are. So zinc L-carnosine as of a study done in 2020, uh, still remarks it as being a relatively new molecule. Um, so it, the benefits of it are very extensive from what we've seen so far already. Um, and it seems like a very promising uh, molecule whenever it comes to the overall healing of the gut and um, reducing things like inflammation. So like the name suggests, zinc L-carnosine is basically a complex of zinc with L-carnosine bound together. Um, so in this formula, we have 22% zinc and 78% L-carnosine. Now zinc plays a key role in maintaining the health and repair of epithelial tissue. Uh, zinc still offers these benefits when it is in the zinc L-carnosine complex. Uh, in fact, it increases the absorption of zinc when it is bound in this complex. And it's also important to note that pepsin GI is actually the only form of zinc L-carnosine that currently meets the FDA requirements of the FDC Act as a new dietary ingredient notification. Uh, it was actually accepted by the FDA way back in 2002. So the pepsin GI version has actually been around for quite a while. Uh, it's not, it's only just until now that we're kind of getting more studies done extensively on this ingredient, highlighting its benefits. Um, it's the only form of zinc L-carnosine that has the proper regulatory basis for the sale and distribution of zinc L-carnosine in the United States. So just throwing that tidbit of, I guess, legality information out there. So zinc L-carnosine is beneficial in restoring gastric lining and healing parts of the GI tract. It has um, clinical use for gastric ulcers and treating many upper GI conditions. Zinc L-carnosine is actually approved for use in Japan and Korea as a prescription drug for the treatment of stomach ulcers. And to highlight this benefit, zinc L-carnosine actually performed better in clinical studies at treating stomach ulcers than cetraxate hydrochloride, which is a commonly used prescription for the treatment of stomach ulcers. So combining zinc and carnosine in this zinc L-carnosine complex increases the absorption of zinc uh, due to increasing the solubility in water and is also able to deliver zinc to tissues in a more time release manner comparing to just uh, taking supplementary zinc alone. Um, in general, conditions related to damaged epithelial cells could benefit by zinc L-carnosine supplementation. And just as a very brief summary of how these uh, effects are taking place. Most of the effects from zinc L-carnosine have been pointed out in studies to be due to its antioxidant and anti-inflammatory mechanisms of action. All right, so let's talk effective dosing. Dosing of 75 milligrams per day was found to reduce gut permeability and provide healing benefits for gastric ulcers. Um, you can increase this dose up to about 150 milligrams per day. Um, and after that, it wasn't really seeing any further benefits. They went all the way up to 300 milligrams per day, um, still basically the same benefits that you would see at 150 milligrams per day. Beneficial effects can be seen as soon as two weeks of continuous daily use, um, though most studies will see most of the improvement after eight continuous weeks of daily use. As I mentioned a little bit in the beginning already, uh, zinc L-carnosine helps with repairing and healing the digestive system as a whole. Uh, this is big uh, because there's not many ingredients out there that are able to heal you know, damaged epithelial tissue. Uh, DGL does to some extent for mucosa, but this is uh, very important and has a lot of promise for a lot of upper GI conditions. So it helps resolve many GI related conditions and disorders. Uh, this can be gas, bloating, stomach pain, heartburn, pancreatitis, uh, even difficulty swallowing. Um, zinc L-carnosine is beneficial for just treatment of GERD, celiac, lactose intolerance, uh, peptic ulcers, 
and proper esophageal functioning. So if you have um, your esophageal sphincter fails and cannot close properly after you uh, are done eating a meal, um, that's how food is able to flow back upwards into the esophagus and give you acid reflux. So people who have GERD uh, experience this almost daily. So if you're someone who suffers from constant heartburn, um, this esophageal sphincter malfunctioning could definitely be the root issue of why you're experiencing this um, on such a consistent basis. So restoring the proper function of the esophageal sphincter can resolve long-term acid reflux issues and um, supplementing with zinc L-carnosine is going to be a great way that we can go about doing this and restoring that proper function. And zinc L-carnosine can also show benefits towards improving disorders that have to do with taste. Zinc L-carnosine is a rather new ingredient um, showing a lot of promise just in repairing overall GI function, more specifically helping to resolve uh, many upper GI conditions. Um, you know, if you suffer from heartburn, if you have, if you know that you have previous damage um, done to the GI tract, I would definitely look into this ingredient. So if you are interested in picking up GI support, which we have zinc L-carnosine in there at 25 milligrams per serving, um, you can go ahead, head over to our site, leviathanutrition.com, go ahead and scroll down. You can check out all the stacks that we have that offer GI support. If you want to buy GI support on its own, scroll down to premium supplements, click on the first link, and there you have it. You can go ahead and make your purchase. Um, hopefully you guys found this video informative. Stay tuned. We will be releasing more videos on uh, breaking down every ingredient that is in this product so you guys can have a better picture of what's going on.